Hey everybody, I'm Johnny Scoble and this is Chase the Heat. This is going to be a fun one. I'm excited about this one. I hope you're doing well. Look what I got today. This is from Rising Smoke Sauce Works. Barbecue Fiery Q. I've done a barbecue series, dates back years. I've done a lot of them. And one of the things I always say is they taste great, but I wish they had one that had a little bite to it. I usually end up doctoring up my own with powders or salt or something like that. Mike Palmatier, Mike and Mary, they're friends of mine. They, you know, I, I do reviews for them. I've done hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of reviews. And I know, you know, all of the makers uh, in one way or another, but these guys are really good friends of mine. I've spent time with them. I've been at shows where booths where we're side by side and stayed in hotels together. They're just great people. I'm really excited about this. You bet. Thank you. Appreciate it. Pretty soon it's gonna, we're going to be in barbecue season. It's beautiful. You can barbecue right now if it weren't for this corona thing going on. Um, but we're excited about this. So, uh, I'll show you the shirt I'm sport today. Rich Newton, Point Blank Pepper Company. Rich and Mindy are great friends of mine also, so I'm sporting their shirt. Thank you guys, hope you're doing well. All right, so let me give you the, uh, read you a little bit about this sauce. When it comes to peppers, we believe you should smoke them if you got them. And there you have it, people. Um, but if you don't, that's cool too. Um, we've developed many uh, tasty and delightful ways to punish and please your tongue. Find your favorite food and start to savor. All right. Uh, whoever said don't fear the reaper, fiery cue, by the way. If it, whoever said don't fear the reaper, never tried this sauce. That's a bold way to start. I love it. Uh, it's a barbecue blend forged in the fires of Hades, featuring blackberries combined with America's most infamous capsaicin carrier, smoked Carolina reapers. Um, be sure to steal your soul and set your taste buds aflame. Here's the, the heat rating on this one. They say it's a monster, so we're kind of excited about that. Let me read you the ingredients. The ingredients were small, so I took a photo of it. Let me read this to you guys. All right, the ingredients are um, tomatoes, smoked Carolina Reaper uh, mash. That's the second ingredient, people. The mash consists of peppers and vinegar. That's it. It's got honey, molasses, Worcestershire sauce consisting of... Uh, distilled white vinegar, molasses, sugar, water, salt, onions, anchovies. Uh, garlic, cloves, tamarind extract, natural flavorings, chili pepper extract. It's got vinegar, blackberries, onion, garlic, sugar, chili powder, salt, mustard powder, and black pepper. So this sounds like it's going to be the thing I've been waiting for. The barbecue sauce has got a little bit of heat. Before I do that, let me show you this. This is a painting by Karen Hayes. I can't remember the name of this. I think it's daisies or something. It's beautiful. Gail, do you happen to know the name of this? Um, abstract coneflowers, I think. Could be abstract coneflowers. Very, very pretty. It's a beautiful painting. All right. All right, so uh, now, are you tainting your sauce still? Jeez, I hope not. There you go. There's the official Chase Tea Hot Sauce Spoon. It's still available at johnnyscold.com, so go check them out. It will not alter the flavor of your sauce. All right, so very excited about this, Mike. Appreciate you sending it to me. We're going to give this away. Here's the consistency of it. Looks like your typical barbecue sauce. Let's get into this. Wow, look what just happened as I took the cap off. The cap just broke. It's unfortunate. It means I have to eat this entire jar right now. Wow. It's got that savory barbecue sauce. You got the garlic, you get the onion, but you're getting the heat. It's got a great aroma. It's savory. It's got a smoky aroma. I dig it. All right, guys, so we're going to get into this. If you've never tried sauces from Rising Smoke Sauce Works, you need to. All right. I've done some challenges with them. Pretty cool stuff. All right, guys, so from Rising Smoke, this is Fiery Q. I'm Johnny Scoble, and this is Chase the Eat. Yes. 
we've got a barbecue sauce here. Great barbecue flavor. You got that smoky flavor. You got the garlic and the onion. Black pepper is key in this in this barbecue sauce. The black pepper is amazing. But absolutely, you get the heat. There's no two ways about it. You would bum out a barbecue if you snuck this in and didn't tell them. Couldn't fake it with anybody. You could not slide this by somebody. Great consistency and texture. This bag and these two beverages. Okay, here's your barbecue sauce. All the times I've said it's great, it says it's hot, but it's not. Here's your barbecue sauce. For somebody who's not accustomed to heat, this is a problem. It has an amazing, savory, smoky. It's incredible. This is just a great barbecue sauce that you're not gonna have to doctor up. Let's talk about the heat. Now, one uh, trait about a Carolina Reaper and Seven Pot Primos, they typically burn the throat. Another thing that, that sauce makers do is use different uh, peppers to get different kinds of burn. I'm getting a little bit of a burn on my tongue, but I'm getting that burn in my throat, which is wonderful. But this is just, I mean, come on, ribs, wings, you know, chicken. This is just a barbecue machine. Uh, a little bit more. The heat on this, for, for somebody who's not accustomed to heat, there's nothing in a grocery store, there's nothing in a mainstream store, barbecue-wise, you're going to get that's going to be this one. There just is it. You can go into mainstream stores and find, so find sauces that are hotter. Some of them have infiltrated mainstream. A lot of them have. But barbecue is one of those still, the barbecue sauce is one of those areas where they're still, they haven't really created something that's, that's got real heat in it yet. This is that. You get the smoked Carolina Reaper flavor. It's delicious. This is, um, so it's definitely going to be like a, um, for a non chili it's going to be like a seven. You know, it really would be. For a, somebody who's chasing the heat and actively eating hot stuff, you're going to be coming in around a five or six for this. This has got heat. If you, I'm serious, if you just did a whole bunch of wings and put this on one wing and put it on a platter, real quick you'd find out who got that wing. No two ways about it. My heat scale, it's very low for me, but my heat scale is really off right now because of all the things I've been doing lately. So it's, you know, my scale doesn't much matter right now, yours does. If you ate this, if you're somebody who's chasing the heat, it's going to be an easy five or six. Somebody who doesn't chase the heat, it's going to be a seven. And if somebody who's never, ever eaten anything hot, I can see where they would eat this and go, wow, this blew my mind. But <clears throat> great, great sauce. Mike and Mary from Rising Smoke Sauce Works, you nailed this. I wonder if I have a cap that I can use that will fix this. I don't know. I'll figure something out because this is a great barbecue sauce. Guys, if you've never tried um, sauce from Rising Smoke Sauce Works, Stop what you're doing. Get some. They're really, really great. There'll be a link in the description box below for them. If you have already tried the sauces from Rising Smokes, by all means, throw a comment in there. Um, I know they're going to read them. I do as well. This one's a delicious barbecue sauce. This is a barbecue sauce, people. Can't wait for it to start grilling. All right. Um, you know what? We got. It's really interesting. We're at a time right now where some bad things are happening, and it's altering plans for people, and everything is just kind of like immediately put on hold, like a pause button on everything. Now is when we need to be our best on our worst day. And we can do that. You know what I mean? We can do that. So be your best today. Be a source of support for somebody because somebody needs it. That's what I'm saying. Um, man, if you look outside, you never know. I'm only a couple, you know, 100 feet from the apartment I live in. Nobody outside. A few people you see walking around. It's just, it's like a Twilight Zone movie. Anyway, you guys are great. I appreciate you taking the time to watch Rich and Mindy again from Point Blank Pepper Company. Love you guys. Let me really quickly talk to tell you about these guys. Rich is a good friend of mine, and Mindy is as well. They, um, just a hobby is what he started out. He is doing this. It's going to be a name you're going to remember. The best smoke rings. Um, I have something hot in my eye. I probably put my finger in my eye. Even if there's nothing hot on my fingers, 
is capsaicin coming out of my fingers. It says on this bottle that the, capsa the best capsaicin carrier around, most notorious, you know, I'm the best capsaicin carrier around. Just kidding. Um, Anyhow, I don't know what I'm saying. You guys are great. I appreciate you taking that much. Oh, uh, Mindy, they have these smoke rings, these uh, pepper rings that are... You open the top once, you may as well throw the top away because you're not going to put them back. So keep your eyes on pepper, uh, Point Blank Pepper Company. Um, you guys are great. I appreciate you watching. Don't taint your sauce, bro. Quit doing that. Um, anyway, I hope you guys are great. Thanks for watching today. We'll catch you guys tomorrow right there. That's our pepper. Click that pepper. Oh, by the way, there's always going to be a pepper at the bottom. Click that any time you can become a subscriber, the, the part of the family. Click that pepper, though. When you do, you are part of this whole thing. If you don't want to miss a video, quit missing videos. Double tap the notification. You won't miss anything. Right there is League of Fire. Man, you have to just love League of Fire. And right there are two relevant videos. I love you, you know. This is Chase D. I'm Johnny Scoville.